94, and this is 2007. I've been operating this great big store with nothing but vinyl. We don't even have a CD player in this store. I needed more space because I knew that this was going to blossom, you know. I had a partner and we had a, we opened a store called the Record Graveyard. Um, we decided to go our separate ways in 1980. Then I opened a store called Garbage Records. And uh, I used to have guys from Japan and Germany and England. I get the English guys still. I get some Japanese. Every once in a while, I'll get someone from Finland or one of them countries, but um, they don't come around as much anymore. I sell records through the mail, through through the mail though, to guys that I've been dealing with for 20, 30 years. You know, I still deal with them. In fact, that's what keeps the place going. If I had to depend on people walking in off the street, there's just not that many people that have record players around. A candy colored clown. I took the shot. All the things are crazy. Candy apple the play. See, if you buy a record and it's already 20 years old and you keep it nice and clean and playable for another 20 years or 30 years or 40 years, there's records in this store that are 50 years old and they're in as good a shape as the day they were put out. It's something special because you're taking care of something, you're preserving something. And I'm, I'm pretty sure that. Someday there'll be albums that are a hundred years old, you know, as people buy records usually take care of them. If you record a CD, like a classic rock album, if you record a CD to a CD, then you record a, a nice clean copy of that record on vinyl, to the CD, you'll see a big difference. It, it will sound better. If, don't ask me why, I just know it does, and everybody who does it records vinyl onto there says the same thing. Now, either we're all crazy, or there's something there, you know? Even the guys that are like audio engineers and something, they still like the, the audio, the, the, that sound of the vinyl, you know? That's, that's making, that's if they're in good shape now, you know? Naturally, CDs are flawless, but if you really like if you really like music, get yourself a record player and dig into this. That's why people from all over the world come here to this country because they realize they love records. You know, people everywhere love records more than Americans. We're too fickle. You know, but that's the way it is. You know? Okay. Right.